welcome to this week's episode of the Saturday Showdown. We have got some exciting news for you tonight. But before we get into any of that, if you are new here, then please could you go down, hit that subscribe button to keep up to date with all the action here at NFHW. But we have got an action-packed card as well as big news. And our opening contest is a number one contendership match for the Rising Phoenix title. Now, what is special about this match between Blair Davenport, Gigi Dolan and Shotzi is the winner will be going up against Oscar at our first ever Monster Rumble that will be happening live over on twitch.tv slash Ninkeso where we will be having five matches plus our Monster Rumble and the big thing about the Monster Rumble is we have got a giveaway to one lucky person if they choose the correct winner of the Rumble now you may be asking yourself how do I go about choosing the winner of the rumble well if you head over to our patreon page which is patreon.com slash linkeso the names of the entrants for the rumble are now there all you need to do is leave a comment on the post and once a name has been claimed then whoever gets that name first has that wrestler in the rumble if they win you will win an exclusive NFHW t-shirt from our merch store. So you don't want to delay. You want to head on over there before the top wrestlers are gone. Because like I said, each wrestler can only be picked once. And it is done on a first come, first serve basis. So make sure while you're over there, you do follow the page. And this is open to all tiers. You don't have to pay. This will be open to the free followers as well. But anyway, let us get back. Oh, and the most important thing is, this live Ronsa Rumble will be taking place next Thursday at 7pm UK time. It will kick off. We've got some great matches before the main event of the Rumble. And both the Ascension title and the Rising Phoenix title will be defended at that first inaugural Monster Rumble show. But anyway, who will be challenging for the Rising Phoenix title? Blair Davenport with the cover. And there we go. Here is your winner, Blair Davenport. Blair Davenport is the lady who will be going on to the inaugural Monster Rumble to challenge Oscar for the Rising Phoenix title. So please put that date in your diary. You do not want to miss out on the first ever Monster Rumble. But now we have got more action for you as Big Daddy is taking on the one-man gang. We joined this match already in action, but we're going to head back and look at what went down at the start of this match. Big Daddy was making his way to the ring. Kieran Donnelly attacking Big Daddy. And we know that last week, Big Daddy was a special guest referee in that match between the Ultimate Warrior and Kieran Donnelly. Kieran Donnelly lost that one, and for some reason... He is blaming Big Daddy over the loss. But Big Daddy is powering on. Despite that initial attack, he is still going ahead with this match against the one-man gang. There's Big Daddy now just stamping away on the back of gang. Oh, one man gang takes Big Daddy down. Referees up to a four count. Gets Daddy up onto his shoulders. Drops him over that, <laughs> over that ring. Referee pleading with the wrestlers to get back in. Finally, Big Daddy sent back into the ring. 
One man gang goes to that line but gets blocked. And now both men just exchanging blows here. Some hard, hard blows. And I think one man gang has been busted open somewhere along the line in this match. And who is going to come out on top of this one? One man gang just asking for Big Daddy. Blocking the attack though, but takes that one to the face. Oh, and now both men just wailing on each other. Big Daddy has one man gang by the beard and a big gut punch. Sends the big man down. Oh, Big Daddy just powering, powering up the one-man gang face first. But one-man gang already back on his feet. Shoulder tackle takes Big Daddy down. Off the ropes. Big, big splash. And there's the cover. And that is going to be it. The one. Picking up the victory over Big Daddy here tonight. But you've got to admit, that was a valiant attempt by Big Daddy after the interference of Kieran Donnelly at the start of the match. Big Daddy still fought on, wasn't successful. And you've got to believe that there, that Kieran Donnelly and Big Daddy are not over yet. I'm sure this is the start of a heated, heated rivalry. But speaking of heated rivalries, we have got two ladies who have been at war with each other over the past few weeks here in NFHW as Morgan Jones and Erica Weave are once again in battle. As Morgan, jo as Morgan Jones sent into the barrier, Erica Weave back in the ring. Oh, Erica Weed risked it all, but no one at home. Morgan Jones was already back in the ring. Morgan Jones just hanging Erica Weave over that top rope. And a big elbow to the outside by Morgan Jones. Morgan Jones has been trying to make an impact for herself since she arrived at NFHW after winning Season 6 of the Wednesday Night Wars. Season 7 is now well underway. And there's a cover by Jones. So make sure you're checking out the Wednesday Night Wars every Wednesday, surprisingly, over on the NFHW YouTube channel, which is where you're watching this. So, you know... You should be able to find this lovely kick there by Jones. Nearly takes Erica's head off her shoulders. But just a two count. Oh, Jones misses that kick. Now, Erica Weeb just raking at the face of Jones. And that is unusual. Erica Weeb is, has that amateur wrestling background. She normally just out wrestles her opponents. But there is definitely a lot of dislike. And into that ankle lock. Morgan Jones in trouble in the centre of the ring. But manages to roll through. Misses the clothesline. German suplex. Erica Weeb in control here. Oh, just drives the knee into the face of Morgan Jones. And there's the angle slam. Probably needs a better name because Erica Weeb's doing it. But that is going to be it. Here is your winner. Erica Weeb. Erica Weeb 
gets the victory, but she appears to be hobbling on that leg. I'm not sure what it is she did to that, to the knee, to the leg, to the ankle. I'm not too sure. But either way, Erica Weave is victorious over Morgan Jones here tonight. But now it is time to find out who will be going on to face the party boy Graza Gates at the Monster Rumble for the Ascension title. And we have got the top three contenders here. Of Edward Pony, Elton Prince and J.K. Roberts. Oh, the 50 pound man Edward Pony planted Elton Prince there. And now he's got a figure four on J.K. Prince is not in the ring. Can he get J.K. Roberts to tap here? Elton Prince back in the ring with that sledgehammer. And a sh swift shot to the midsection of the 50 pound man. But can't put him away. Edward Pony managing to kick out. Oh, JK misses. Elton Prince using his levitation ability here. Slowly lowers himself to the arena floor. And that is one way to prevent a hard fall out of the ring. Edward Pony taking his eyes off of his opponents. That was a big mistake there. And now JK in the ring with that sledgehammer. And Edward Pony just taking down both JK, but Elton Prince fighting back. And all three of these men suffering in this one neck breaker by JK it's Elton Prince looking good down the chair say hello to the chair you two Of course, Elton Prince, former Ascension Champion. J.K. Roberts was an Ascension Champion in full house wrestling back in the day when we ran live shows. There's a cover by Prince. But Edwards sees what's going on, breaks it up, drives Elton into his knee. And there it is, the 50 pound dream. He's got it cinched in. And that is it. The winner by way of submission, the 50 pound man, Edward Pony. The 50 pound man, Edward Pony, victorious here tonight. So he will be going on to the Monster Rumble to face the party boy, Graza Gates. For the Ascension title, remember that is happening live over on twitch.tv slash Ninkeso this Thursday, 7pm UK time. And the names of the wrestlers are now up on our Patreon channel, patreon.com slash Ninkeso. If you want to pick a wrestler and have a chance to win that t-shirt. But now we have got the NFHW title on the line as the Ultimate Warrior defending against Voodoo. Voodoo defeated the Warrior in a non-title matchup a couple of weeks ago to earn this spot here tonight. But the Ultimate Warrior has just been devastating as champion. Running through all his opponents. Oh, big back body drop there by Voodoo. And you've got to wonder who is going to stop the Warrior. Of course, El Gran Queso, who is in action after this match. 
is the number one contender who'll be facing the, whoever the champion is at episode 25. And can the warrior keep hold of that title up until then? Oh, big boot to the face of the warrior. As Voodoo going up to that top rope. Big elbow. Connecting, but hurting his own arm, I think, a little there. Just a one count. The ultimate warrior kicking out on one after a top rope elbow. That shows you just how powerful the warrior is. But Voodoo showing disrespect there, just walking over the warrior. And a big knee. Voodoo pump handle. Gets him up. Drives him into the canvas. Doesn't go for a cover though. I think he knows he needs to do something extra big to the warrior to be able to put him away. And remember, if you'd like to see this match in its entirety, that is one of the perks for our paid members over on Patreon. So if you would, if you can, help support us over there. That is really, really appreciated. But the best thing you can do to help us out is hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Leave a comment as they are all three ways of helping this channel grow. Oh, big kick there by the Warrior. But Voodoo just running through the Ultimate Warrior. Close line. The Warrior getting Voodoo up. Drops him down. Big splash. That could be it. But Voodoo already getting back up. Warrior sends him off the ropes. Oh, and the, just launches him into the air. Voodoo in trouble and once again Voodoo is up high Warrior dropping Voodoo there's a pin just a two count Voodoo managing to kick out Warrior off the ropes big splash and there's another cover and that is going to be it. Here is your winner and still the NFHW champion, the Ultimate Warrior. The Ultimate Warrior once again retaining the NFHW championship. And you've got to start wondering who is going to be able to stop the Ultimate Warrior as the Warrior has just been rolling through absolutely everybody here at NFHW but anyway it is now time for our main event and we've got two gentlemen who are at, up at each other's heads and last week at the end of the show a cage mysteriously dropped down around Salsa and El Gran Queso after the Salsa's match with Typhoon so this week we are having a cage match. Salsa managed to get the bet, the upper hand to Queso at the end of last week when Queso jumped Salsa. But now they are locked inside this cage. And the only way to win in this match is pinfall and submission. We are not escaping the cage tonight. Spring Bull Moonsault, but nobody home. The Salsa sends Queso into the cage, but I think Queso managed to put the brakes on. Gets caught as he tried to follow up into the corner. And there's that Moonsault. And these two guys know each other so well. They used to be part of the Cheesy Nachos together along with guacamole but for whatever reason El Gran Queso turning his back on the nachos salsa and guacamole 
And remember, episode 24, El Gran Queso took on both Salsa and Guacamole in that handicap match where he was victorious. So you've got to wonder, can Salsa get the job done by themselves inside this steel cage? As Queso going up to that top row, misses the splash. If he had hit that, that would have ball, that would have been over. Queso okay, going up to that second rope, hits the splash this time. But luckily for Salsa, it was only from the second. And Salsa managing to kick out, but barely. I think the wind has been taken out the sails of Salsa. DDT by Salsa. Can he build on this? Going up to that top rope. Lovely moonsault. There's a cover. But again, just a one count. Queso getting his shoulders up. And Salsa just wrenching that arm around that top rope. And there's another DDT. Queso in trouble here. A Salsa lovely Tomonagi throw. Oh, big headbutt though. Queso stays on his feet but gets taken down by that moonsault. And a Rana. Lovely move by Queso. There's a cover. And that is going to be it. Here is your winner, El Gran Queso. El Gran Queso victorious. But that is all the time we've got for you tonight. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. To keep up to date with all the action here on NFHW.